Welcome to install Harmony One Wallet and create your first one address. First thing we're going to do is open up your browser and search for Harmony One Wallet Chrome extension. And if it populates, you can just go ahead and click it. It should be that very first link right there, chrome.google.com. Go ahead and click on that and you see on the right, add to Chrome. Go ahead and click that, acknowledge the permissions, and add extension. You'll then see it appear in the top right-hand corner, showing that it's been added to Chrome, although it may be hidden by your extension little puzzle piece there. Go ahead and click the little pin to the right of it, and you'll see it appear in your bar. When you click on the extension for the first time, it'll prompt you to create an account. Go ahead and give it a name. Doesn't matter what you name it, just something you can recognize. Next thing we're going to do is go ahead and type in a password. Now this is a password just to open that wallet and keep it secure. Like if you want to pull out the private key and save that. The next thing we have down here is our seed phrase. That is super important. This is your master password for the address we are about to create. Without that, you lose all access to that address and all funds within. Keep it safe. Keep it super safe. This is super important. We're going to go ahead and click to copy, and then we're going to go ahead and copy it over into Notepad. The next thing we're going to do is check the box to acknowledge that we saved those seed words, because if you lose them, you lose access to this address and all funds in it forever. Click Next. This is so important that they have you enter those 12 words just to make sure you saved them. No worries. You just read off the notepad, press them in the right order, and when you're done, you'll be good to go. But if you make a mistake, no big deal. You can click clear in the corner there and reset it. Start all over, no big deal. I want to point out here that if I was actually going to use this wallet, I would not be sharing these seed words with you. By sharing these seed words, I have given every single person who watches this video full access to any funds that I send to this address. Big no-no. Just like your email or bank passwords, keep these private. Next up is to create a four-digit PIN and repeat it just to secure access to this extension from within Chrome. You'll see that you have then created your account and only have one more thing to show you. After you've completed, and you open up the Chrome extension there, you see your new address. This is your public address that you can share with people.